Libras, hello, hello. Thank you for tuning in to Perfectly Imperfect Tarot. This is Green Eyes, here to give you April mid-month 2020, baby. Yes, 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 Libra gang. You know I'm always excited about your read because it's my read too, and I don't read for myself. Okay, guys, quick, quick, quick. Thank you. Your likes, shares, subscribes, your comments, your love tokens and donations. I truly appreciate each and every one. Thank you so, so, so very much. I really, really, really do. Um, everything is pre-shuffled. Oracles are laid out. I do not read from the floor. However, um, even though everything is upright, I will read it reversed if it comes out on the clarifier. Okay. Uh, cross watchers. I am a snitch, snitch, snitch. I'm telling you now. Okay. Please don't curse me in the comments. I love you too, but this is Libra's read. So I have to read the cards for Libra. All right. Um, guys, uh, I have some new information in my description box for those who, uh, maybe are seeking help, uh, domestic violence, child abuse, uh, suicide prevention, that's now available and I'm going to have it on every video as well as on the about tab of my channel. So please um, utilize that information if uh, you need to. Okay, now we got that out the way. Libras, what is going on? You know, uh, first of all, I have to tell you, that, you know, lately we've been waiting for this brand new uh, epiphany in our love lives. And um, we did the good bra thing. And then we said, you know what, Nick said, I'm going to live my life. So that's pretty much the, the vibe I've been on. I don't know about you guys, but that's the vibe that I'm actually uh, getting also. Um, but I want to tell you something funny. Uh, earlier today, I had to go to the store talking to my neighbor, an older gentleman, you know, ask him if you need anything because we're in the middle of this crisis, you know, and I know he uh, shouldn't be out. I'll say it like that. Old enough that he shouldn't be out. Oh, man, Libras. He said, you know what? I got both my eyes on you. I said, oh, Mr. Such and Such, you know, uh, thank you. I appreciate you. I'm thinking he looking out. I'm looking out. He said, no, you a grown woman. You know what I'm talking about. Libras. I'm like, Mr. Such and Such, go ahead in the house, you know. I got in my car. I, I had to stop. Like, what, what, what in the world? <laughs> Libras, I'm telling you. It was, you know, I got my eye on you. You know what I mean? Come on. Oh, I ain't going to lie. I said, well, wait a minute. Maybe this is my day. I started looking in my purse for some lip gloss because I ain't had my good bra on. But then I realized I got to put a damn mask on anyway. It ain't going to make a difference. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all, let's get into it. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I just thought that was funny. Let's talk about this King of Cups. All right, now, uh, uh, water energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, but you know, the signs don't matter. Everybody has the uh, ability to invoke whatever uh, sign at any given time. So we just gonna talk about this cup of love that somebody wants to give that we've been talking about for quite some time. So I really wasn't impressed or surprised to see this Knight of Cups at the bottom of the deck. So the Knight of Cups, yeah, they coming with this Knight of Swords. Libra, 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 Libra. I got something to tell you, all right? Because you know that's uh, communication, uh, strong communication coming in quick, fast. But we don't want to be bothered with that. Four Cups energy here. Um, you know, we, we don't want it. We don't want it. We want more. All right, and don't nobody want that. Don't nobody want it. Nope, 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 nope. Yep, because we jumped into our own energy. Queen of Swords, Libra energy. We said, you know what? You're going to have to raise the vibe up in this mofo, okay? Not with that one cup. I don't want to hear it. I'm not going to bullcrap you. We're going to keep this straightforward and to the point. And you know what? Bam. <laughs> Libras, when I saw this king... I was like, oh, don't call it a comeback. 
Libras, he is uh, going to raise the, he or she, you know, this is not gender specific. He going to raise the vibe up and talk some trash right back to you. I'm trying to tell you, okay, somebody is, they, 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 they coming in as a knight. They coming in fumbling a little bit, but they got some strong words, but they going to raise the vibe and, 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 uh, definitely, <clears throat> excuse me, try to take control of the conversation. So now Libra is we on our look. I know who I am. I know where I stand. I know I don't want no foolishness at all with this seven of wands energy back. Get back. No, 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 no. But they want this ten of cups. They want to be happy. And they see us as being happy. All right? But they're a wounded warrior or we're a wounded warrior. Somebody's, you know, feeling like, you know, uh, I got a little fight left in me. I got a little fight left in me. Okay? And with this fight... Uh, and with the, well, I'm sorry, what's left in them, it's because of this temperance energy, Sagittarian energy. Um, you know, this is being sensible about things. This is, uh, being logical, uh, about things after a time of, uh, reflection, self-reflection. You know what I'm saying? So somebody is feeling that temperance energy and they make a move. Make that move right now, baby. Jumped on the chariot and said, take me to my Libra. And you know when the chariot is moving, because this is a divine movement, there ain't no brakes on it. It don't stop until it reaches its destination, okay? Cancer energy. And they see you as this destination with the sun. You understand? Leo energy. Because... Either they have changed or you have changed, you know? And what more importantly, they see the change. They see the change or you are going to see a change in that individual. Because they are going to level up, okay? Now, once this change takes place, okay. Let's go back to the drawing board. And try it again because this is going to be this is going to be now the conversation is out the way the action is going to have to start taking place we're going to have to put the money where the mouth is okay put the money where the mouth is all right so they got to figure out how to do that how am i going to make this happen how am i going to make the what can i do differently you know what can i do differently because they've already now said some things that they haven't uh yet i'm talking about this process here now this is a process mid-april um but again you got to go whatever cycle you're in in your life you know what i mean energy is fluid but they got to make this move uh they just got to figure out how to do it they're trying to figure out something like new and fresh and like that you ain't never seen before to impress you you understand what i'm saying um, and that's what like is really having this person stuck because they know they, they supposed to be with you at this point. It's not even a want. It's a, it, it's not, it's more than a desire. It's, it's like that spiritual connection. You know, they, they feel like you're the one period. You're the one Libra. I mean, but Hey, they're ready to have equal give and take. They're ready to be fair. They're ready to be balanced. They're ready to provide. Okay. Um, and they know that you can do the same for them. Boom. And they're coming. They traveling across mountains and seas and lakes and and uh, plateaus and deserts and valleys and whatever the case to get to Libra. Okay? Whatever the case. You know? They're going to make that. They're going to take that chance and, and make that gamble. Now, of course... At this point, I don't even know if they're coming with the mask on or uh, they're going to wait till this epidemic is over, but somebody's coming, okay? I'll tell you that right now. Because they see you as everything they want, all right? With the Six of Wands energy. Everything. You are above the, the rest. Above the rest, okay? And you deserve it period. There's only one problem. Just one. I'm going to say just one, but I'm not sure. But I know that's what I heard when I saw this moon. We got one problem. 
and I can't tell you what it is. Ain't that a mother loving blip? I was like, for real? <laughs> oh man, all you gonna come with all this good, good, good with these cards just flowing so good. And you know, definitely, uh, you know, I felt like you know, somebody is coming that was gonna treat Libras like they know they should be treated. And here we go with this foolishness. Again, Seven of Swords energy, especially with the moon. And, you know, you're going to have to decide if whether or not this is somebody you can trust. And that's going to be the issue, trust. It's not a love problem. It's not a connection problem. It's not, um, uh, you know, it, it's, it's not nothing like that. You know, I mean, I, I've said it before. You can love somebody dearly. I mean, and they love you back and will beat the hell out of you. Like, let's just keep it decent. All right? So, do you trust what's hidden behind the moon? Now, this is where I stopped. I just want to take a peek. We got a page of cups. You had a love offer. It, yeah, it's going to take some strength, guys. Yeah, because we want justice. We want, uh, we, you know, we're demanding it. Look at that. I should have kept going. We're going to go together. Yup. Because we left. Ain't that something? With that six of swords. Yeah, we left. <laughs> and started working on ourselves. Seven of pentacles. And turned into nine of pentacles. <laughs> Libra. All right. I need to leave these pookas alone. You know I can stay with these all day. Woo. Okay, let's talk about your oracles. I, I didn't honestly see nothing I, I wasn't surprised about. Uh, and you're going to feel the same way. Okay. Um, center energy, we're starting with judgment, justice. Uh, I'm sorry, judgment. Uh, you know, this is, this is us. You know, demanding what we expect. We're demanding respect. We're giving it so we expect it back. Period. We're giving it. We're giving it and we expect it back. Treat me like I treat you. If you can't do that, then you need not be here. In my life, in my space, in my energy, wasting my time, uh, that, uh, you know, somebody else can fill that slot who uh, understands and respects who I am and, you know, what I'm worth. And this includes friends and family. Okay? I'm talking about, I mean, I, I'm like, I'm talking about your kids. Everybody. Okay? Understand the sacrifices that I make. Absolutely. We're coming from that transformation. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful transformation, of course. Death energy. Yeah, we change. We've definitely uh, metamorphosized, you know, into something absolutely beautiful. I love this uh, green here. It just, it, it just reminds me of new life. You know what I mean? Um, beautiful, beautiful energy. Death energy is scorpion energy. That is moving into accelerated motion. This is spiritual energy, guys. This energy here is is fast. Okay, um, it's a little more than you know, and it's uh, from the divine. Okay, like I said, it's spiritual energy, but it's like a black hole or like a, a wind stream, uh, like a. a not a tornado, like a wind stream, like a, you know, you know what I mean? Like sometimes if you fly, they'll say we caught a wind and then you'll land a little sooner. It's, it's, it's forceful, you know, it's like uh, the current in water. If you get caught by the current, you know, it could just swoop you. You know what I mean? That's this kind of energy. We're getting ready to excel so fast that all we have to do is take the ride. Boom. All you got to do is take the ride. I cannot wait to clarify our future energy. Now, crowning us, didn't we talk about this? Discontent and boredom. Libras have absolutely zero patience. We don't. I, I'm, I'm saying we because I'm including myself in this, and I know I don't. Zero. We over it and we're over being over it. Where is it? What when is it gonna come? Ba, 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 ba. You know, it, it don't work like that. You have to free yourself. You know, we have to free ourselves 
uh, from the mindset of right now and just know and trust that it's coming in divine timing. Know and trust that it's coming in divine timing. If it's love that you're looking for, it's coming. If it's stability that you're looking for, it's coming. You know, it's coming and it's coming in divine timing. And when it hits us, all we're gonna have to do is take the ride. Trust the ride, okay? Because it's coming. And what's undermining us is our patience. The waiting game. This is what's slowing down the process because we're not trusting the damn process. We have to trust the process. I had absolutely no business talking to God about is today gonna to be the day looking for damn lip gloss in my purse when I know I gotta put this mask on and go into the market. I had no business doing that, I'll admit it. But that's why I told that story earlier uh, so that you really understand how like this energy is for all of us. It's not just you, I'm talking about me too. We have to learn to trust the process. We have to learn patience. We have to learn that divine is in charge. Why? Because we allowed and prayed for the divine to lead and guide us. You know, we, we said that we were going to wait on God to move in our lives. And now you calling him back. Did you forget about me? Hello? <laughs> JC. <laughs> it's me, Libra. Come on. Bottom of the deck, foundation and achievements. Guys, it's coming. Foundation and achievements. Foundation and achievements. So we're not only being blessed, okay, on what we've done. We're also being uh, placed on a solid foundation to build for the future. So we're being set up. You understand what I'm saying? Oh, damn. I ain't even see that. Under that, love begins. Ooh. Oh, under that, material harvest. Ah, under that, look at that. Patience. <laughs> Leave rise. An intuition was under that. Good, Google booger. I can't with y'all. Bottom of uh, the tarot clarifiers was the Empress and the Nine of Pentacles. We're just loving ourselves right now. And you know what? Oh, it feels good. It feels so good to love me. I know it feels good, y'all. I know you loving it too. It feels so good to love me. I'm telling you. If I can get my patience together, I'll be all right. But everything else, good. On the money. Let's talk about this transformation energy. Past and thank you. Oh, yes. Star energy. Piscean energy. Love it. Okay. Uh, this is that spiritual journey that we've on, that spiritual transformation that we've just gone through, that elevation that we've just uh, been blessed with, um, just uh, the that 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 calm, that peace, you know, that might be beyond all understanding. You know what I'm saying? People might not even understand how Libra is just okay with being Libra today. Now, yesterday we weren't, but today we good. And when I say yesterday, you know, I mean the entire last year and, and a couple of months ago. But you know what I'm saying? Depending on your process. All right. Let's talk about the star energy, please, on top. Thank you. Yep. We were deceiving ourselves. I'm going to just put it out there. I'm sorry. We were deceiving ourselves. You know, the truth was there. But we were deceiving ourselves, and it's okay, you know. We have transformed now into something new and wonderful. You know what? I'm not even going to worry about it. We're not going to worry about it because what's done is done. We learned from it, okay, which is most important. So we know we're not going to repeat that, okay? We're moving on to our new cycle. But, um, yeah, I'm looking at the Seven of Swords. Like, I think y'all want one more, okay? Yeah, Queen of Cups energy. Uh, we, like I said, we were deceiving ourselves. Uh, lo uh, not, not love with deceiving. I want to say that right. Okay, hold on. Um, we were thinking with our heart and not our head. With this Queen of Cups energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. This is emotions. This is emotions. Okay. 
Let's talk about truth. Current energy for Libra. Clarify, please. Thank you so much. Whoa, Queen of Wands. Let's see, that's when you bust up in the mother like, hello, I'm here. Fire, baby. Yes, Leo, Aries, Sag, energy, passion, driven, uh, spirit protected, okay? Um, marriage material from head to toe, but don't mind being single. We'll run an entire kingdom with no problem, with no problem. And this is what I'm saying. This is, you know, with this uh, judgment here. Yeah, we, 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 we calling all cars, calling all cars. Let everybody know I'm not playing no more. I'm done, 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 been done. So, but because you didn't take it off of my actions and acting like you didn't understand, uh, from, I'm sorry, you didn't take it off my words and acting like you didn't understand when I told you. Now I'm showing you. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? Now I'm living this life. I'm done. Queen of Wands energy. Thank you so much. <laughs> Seven of Wands again. <laughs> we just saw this transpire with the Pukas, okay? Seven of Wands again. Libras, first of all, we fighting people that's beneath us every one is beneath us they not even on your level but they trying to climb up to your level and you was like not by my back like i'll help you up just ask me believe me i will but don't wait till i turn my back and then steal my space you understand what i'm saying we're not doing that no more. Mm -mm. We're not giving away our power no more. You're not stealing nothing from me energetically no more. Ask me. I'll give it to you if I feel like you deserve it. You understand what I'm saying? Tell me more about this current energy. For Lee, thank you so much. Eight of Swords. They know, Libra. Somebody knows. Everybody's starting to get it. Because they feel it's dry. the well is drying out. You see that at the bottom of the card? You see the 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 see the lake then dried out. Libra was the water. Okay, providing our spiritual energy, feeding and and uh, covering everybody's thirst in the valley. You not realizing that we was killing ourselves. We were binding ourselves to that situation. You understand what I'm saying? Ooh. Tell me more, Spirit. Thank you so much. Knight of Pentacles, reverse. Oh, baby. But they get it. They didn't, Somebody putting a pep in their step. This is, some, you know, a Knight of Pentacles is somebody coming to you with a token of value. Be it, uh, you know, uh, something tangible. Not necessarily a gift, but something to show you that um, they're coming with proof. Let's put it like that. They're coming with proof. That's this person. All right. I want to give you this coin because I know that, you know, I I'm serious. The problem is that this is the slowest friggin' night in the damn deck out of all the nights. Okay. This night moves like a turtle with hemorrhoids. I say it all the time. It's slow as heck. But it came out reverse. Somebody getting a, a pep in their step. This horse is no longer, you know, uh, what do you call it? Uh, what do the horses do? They they not walking. They galloping. How about that? Tell me about this Knight of Pentacles reverse current energy. Thank you. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Queen of Swords. <laughs> Libras. Yes. When they get there, we go. <laughs> Woo, Queen of Swords. And you know, this is Libra's energy. This is straightforward. This is strong communication. Let me tell you, look at her hand. Look at the hand. Sword is in one hand, but let me tell you one thing. So we don't have no misunderstanding. Blah, 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 blah. That's where Libra is at today, okay? Tell me more. Queen of Swords energy. Thank you so much. 
we got a three of wands and a knight of wands. Yeah, so like I said, that knight getting a pep in their step because now we done moved to a knight of wands. Yeah, that's... <laughs> That's action after they've been stalled, okay? Because what they did was they talked to, uh, somebody talked to you and you stalled them. Or, you know what I mean? That, like they had to rethink, they got to regroup. You stalled them. So now they got to, they, they coming back, but they coming back with a little more. Just a little bit more. Oh, you know what? Let me just have one on this Knight of Wands and I'm going to get off of this. <laughs> Wheel of Fortune again. Guys, this person is traveling. Wow. And you know what? I, I'm, I'm, I, this is more like traveling, you know. It, it, it. Ooh. They're shaking the dice for Lady Luck, like, you know, <laughs> trying to get a seven. What is it? Seven, eleven? I don't know, y'all. I don't play dice, but they're gambling. They're taking a gamble. And when I say traveling, I don't mean physically. Maybe some physically, but more spiritually. Like, this person is digging deep. Digging deep. Trying to figure out who, what, where, and how am I going to get my Libra? I got to get my Libra. I, they call in all cars. Like, I, I really feel like that. Like, they pulling out all the stops here with this Wheel of Fortune. I mean, pulling out all the stops with expect. I mean, they, they had to change it up. That's what I said. They, you know, they said, look, let me, let me change this up. I'm going to restart. This is how I'm going to come to you now. It's like, you know, they back and forth trying to figure out how to get the, the completion or how to get uh success you know with obtaining you know this life with you the only problem is like i said in the first place love was never the problem what you're going to do right discontent and boredom crowning this read for libras tell me thank you <laughs> Oh, Libras, justice. Libras, you are all over this thing. I'm telling you, all over it. You know, this is, uh, we said, we, we, if you know, no Roger, no rerun, no rent. I'm not playing. <laughs> Libras, I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't say it enough how much we're over it. I understand that. I would love to say something different and new, like the number tomorrow is going to be that, that, that. I, I don't have it. It's just a cycle that's just, we're just fluid in this cycle right now, okay? We're fluid in this energy right now, excuse me. We're just really, really fluid in this energy. We just know we ain't taking no mess. Tell me about this. Thank you. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Libras, shut it down. You hear me? We are shut. This is somebody that <laughs> said, be gone. Poof. I'm telling you, Libra, some of y'all is really shutting this thing all the way down. All right. You're saying, I don't want no, no nothing. I, you, I don't want a peanut butter sandwich from you. You can't do nothing for me ever. Dang. That's how y'all feel? Jeez. Yeah. Goodness gracious. So, yeah, they, you know, they had a little tower moment because of rejection. And they felt, you know, left out in the cold because rejection hurts. It does. You know, but life goes on. Tell me about the waiting game. Why is this energy undermining Libra's read? Thank you so much. Oh, wow. Patience is a virtue. Patience is a virtue. Look at this. You have the, the Sun Leo energy, which is the happiest card in the deck. So why is this energy undermining us? Because it's taking too long. Okay? It's taking too long. Why do we have to get one cup at a damn time when I put an order in for 10? All right? I put the order in for 10 cups. I know I did. I got the confirmation number. Hello? 
Okay. Libras, we have to calm down. We do. We got to calm down. All right. First, we remember had to go through the realization that we were fooling ourselves with the connection that we had. Okay. And that once that was realized, we had to go through that death energy and really reinvent ourselves and come out new and fresh and clean, shedding all of that bad karma, that hurt, uh, that heartache, um, you know, shedding all of that, the, you know, coming out of that, you understand what I'm saying? Shedding that bad skin. All right. Embracing who we are individually, what we deserve, how we treat people and what we expect, you know, uh, from others. You understand what I'm saying? And being OK, if we know that they're not capable of getting it, giving it, you know, that's fine. You, I'm not for you. You're not for me. For those that are coming back, you know, saying that, you know, Libra, I want you. I want you. I change. I change. We're recognizing um, that. No, this is talk. You understand? We're seeing through the foolishness uh, with that Queen of Swords energy and justice on the board. We're seeing right through the foolishness. So no, we're not. We're not doing that. And some of y'all is just shutting it completely down. Like, uh, hello, Tower moment, Five of Pentacles. Bye. Woo. Mm mm mm. And they leaving. Look at that. Look at that. And the little piece of love that they have for you, or uh, uh, I'm sorry, the little piece of you. How am I supposed to, I'm trying to say something. Hold on, because they took a piece of you with them. Hold on. I just want to say it right. It's not something that you're supposed to have. It was the connection, that last connection, like that tie. Do that make sense? What do you call that? That birth string. Oh, God, why can't I? I'm a mother, and it won't come out my mouth. The umbilical cord, uh, once that's cut, once th this tower moment is going to cut that cord, you understand? And they're going to take that with them th th because whatever was connecting you spiritually or what have you, energetically, call it what you want, um, but they're going to take that piece with them because you're, you're breaking that tie completely. You're breaking that and moving on with your life, okay? So if they're going to transform, then now is the time because it, it, it's going to be a fresh start if they do, okay, once that rejection goes through. Accelerated motion. Tell me. Thank you. I see you peeking, baby. Page of swords. Now, this can also be a text, a lighthearted uh, phone call. Hi, how you doing? I just wanted to, you know... Make sure y'all were okay, you know, during this time. You know, something innocent, um, nothing personal. Page of Swords energy. Uh, tell me more. Tell me more about the Page of Swords on top of, thank you. Yep. Chariot again. Here we go. Here comes that ride. Tell me about this chariot. Tell me about this chariot, please. More. More information for thank you. See that damn moon. Shoot. Huh. I wanna say Libras that whether or not somebody's coming is not in question. How they're coming might be that one thing it's not maybe changing the intentions it's not changing the intentions because it's still leading to something good we're just gonna have to trust it tell me um yeah tell me more about this moon we're gonna you, you know can you trust the moon i, I feel that wow Wow. All right, Libras, let me say this. Seriously? Um, Nix this who? Let me just talk about this blessing. Uh, this blessing that's coming through for us 
is so decent. Like I, 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 I would love to tell you it's just uh, divine and love and bl bliss and awesome sauce all rolled into one. But this is it, it, and it's for us. This accelerated motion. This is the elevation. This is awesome sauce. Like, and we're not gonna see it where it's coming from because it's gonna happen so fast. But we're about to be set. We're about to be set and set up like good, really good. Wow. In order to do that though, we gotta trust the moon. Woo I just want, I'm sorry. Magician and Temperance, tell me more please for Libra. Magician and Temperance, tell me more please for Libra. Wow, I got chills. Magician and Temperance, tell me more. Thank you so much. God darn it. Five of Cups. Woo, Libra, some of y'all ain't gonna see it. I wanna see it. Some of y'all not gonna see it. God darn it. You're not gonna see that something's really small is gonna set the stage. Something, a small, a, 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 a something. It's gonna be a small nugget. Hey Libra, how you doing? What's going on? Did you hear about such and such? Or I don't know, did you apply for such and such? Or did this grant or whatever the case is. Whatever it is, you know, uh, something available that you weren't even thinking of. or such and such asked about you, you know, something like that. It's really small, but it's going to start a whirlwind of energy, a whirlwind of divine energy that uh, this chariot is going to basically take over, but we're not going to be able to see it. We're going to have to trust the journey of this chariot. You understand what I'm saying? You're not going to, God darn it, that's what I'm saying. You're not going to know the destination. Hello. Mm, mm. You got to trust the journey. You're not going to know the destination. Maybe a blind date or, you know, a blind hookup, um, a job that comes through. You know, somebody, you know, I was thinking about you. Or such as, it's something like that. It's something blind. You understand what I'm saying? And I don't do blind dates. I'm going to tell you that right now because I might be the one that can't see it. But it's being manifested. <laughs> For your benefit. For your benefit. To straighten you out. God darn. That, wait a minute, let me see. <laughs> ah! Libras, we gonna think it's too good to be true. Seven of Cups, we gonna think it's an illusion. God, some of us, some of us. I ain't gonna say we. Let's put a claim on victory on that. Absolutely. You're right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just, I really, and I just said, I, what did I just say? I said, I'm going to be the ones that's not going to see it. I'm not going to see the two cups behind. That's what I said. I'm not going to see it. So let me rephrase. Oh, for Libras to the divine, I apologize. I want to claim victory <laughs> on this energy. Come on, magician and temperance. Hello? Let's get some... Thank you. Final messages for Libra. Thank you for this read, please. Final messages, please, for... Ooh. For Libra. Last run. Final messages for Libra. That's it? Okay. Libras! You need a good effing cry, Libras? Go on in the closet. Do what you got to do. Get at your ugly cry on. All right? Let that ish go. Your soul will thank you. Some of y'all feeling nostalgic. You got some old stuff coming through. I understand. But you know what? You're giving too many fucks. Okay? You know how many you should give? Absolutely zero. Hello? You look like it. it shit, shit. I know. Libras. All right? Comb your hair. 
Get the good brow. All right? Make yourself feel better. Put some lip gloss on. Just walk around popping. That's all. When you walk around and make your coffee in the morning, cooking breakfast, just make sure you're popping. You'd be surprised little things like that just make you feel good. Why? Because you're a hot damn mess. All right? Fat. Clean yourself up. You got a feeling you just can't shake Libras. That little voice inside you, listen to that ish. Absolutely. Libras, I truly enjoyed sharing this reading with you as always. I do, I do, I do. Guys, if you resonated with this energy, please like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment. Um, if you don't, check your moon and rising, but do not take this energy with you, okay? Leave it here for someone else. And remember, we are all perfectly imperfect. Stay safe.